Hey girls and guys, it's Presley, and today in this video, I'm going to be talking about a crazy story that happened at Hobby Lobby. Trust me, it gets good at the end. So keep on watching. Anyway, it all started back on June the 19th, which was a couple weeks ago, I think. So it was during the weekend, by the way, just so you know. So my mom and I went to Hobby Lobby, little arts and crafts store, just so um, I could find a frame for my diploma. And sadly, couldn't find any luck or any frames that would fit my diploma because my diploma was pretty small. So um, the weekend after, which was last weekend, um, my mom and I went to Hobby Lobby again. And um, we were trying to find something that would like manage to at least fit the diploma. And thankfully an employer, shout out to him by the way, was able to help us um, find something that would make the um, my diploma fit in the frame so it can like so it doesn't show any weird spots or crookedness or whatever and um, it's all good it's all right back there and um, I didn't get any extra frames for my um, certifications because they already came in frames once I received them for re rewards excuse me for um, for the awards assembly at school so they already came in frames, thank goodness. So the only frame I had to get was one for my diploma. And as soon as we were about to leave, my mom and I were about to leave Hobby Lobby, oh boy, these two girls, they were probably mother and daughter, cousins, maybe girlfriends, who knows, just walking around shopping, and that's not the crazy part. The crazy part is what they were wearing. What they were wearing were just bras. No tank top, no short sleeve shirt, just bras. And I get it. It's summertime. It's really hot in Texas. You start sweating and I get it. I get it. You want to at least wear something that's like, you know, not too hot. But bras? Really? I mean, come on. Like... I, I know this is too much information for me to um, for me to tell you, but I did say in my YouTube channel that I would talk about different topics and crazy stories throughout my life. So this is one of them. And if you don't like it, then uh, you don't have to watch these types of videos anymore. Just saying. Just saying. Don't unsubscribe just because I said crazy stuff like this. I'm just saying. But anyway, back to the um, back to the story. Anyway, they were wearing bras. And I told my mom, I looked over and I was like, what the fuck? And I told her, why in the hell are they wearing bras? Like, this isn't Walmart. And she started laughing when I said that because people at Walmart wear the most craziest things at Walmart. Like, it's ridiculous. It's like they have no filter. And it's like Walmart doesn't have a dress code for the employees. Like, they don't even control the people at Walmart who wear the most craziest stuff. Like there was a time when I was at Walmart and um, and this one dude who was wearing a purple tank top with his um, underarms showing and um, sliders and boxers, like full on underwear boxers. That's ridiculous. And I'm surprised those two girls at Hobby Lobby didn't even get kicked out because of their wardrobe. It's ridiculous. I was, I was thinking, what the fuck? And my mom was thinking the same thing too. I'm, su I'm still surprised they didn't, they didn't get kicked out to this day. And um, as soon as my mom and I were walking out to, um, towards my mom's car so we can leave to go home, we saw those girls walk by go, um, going to Sweet Frog. And my God, <laughs> I get it. It's hot. It's scorching hot here in Texas. Like, Texas is the most hottest state you can go to. Well, in Florida and Arizona, those, those states are pretty hot too, but Texas, shit, it's fucking hot, hot as shit. And I get it. But they should just wear at least a short sleeve shirt, a tank top, something that'll at least cover some skin. I bet, I bet back in the day they probably didn't even um, 
they probably even broke the rules at, um, at school because you know what school has a dress code and I'm pretty sure those two girls mother and daughter cousins girlfriends who knows they probably broke the dress code plenty of times oh man that is insane anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this little crazy story and trust me I'm not lying when I tell you crazy stories like this this stuff happens every now and then crazy stories like this I wish I could tell you I was making this stuff up, but I'm not. I Trust me, I'm not. I don't lie to you guys. I really don't lie to you guys. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.